Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Cadence of Hyrule. Today we are continuing our exploration throughout Hyrule and going to the Gerudo Desert, which is what we explored a couple of episodes ago, just a little bit, but now that we defeated the most recent um, Wizrobo boss at this temple, I don't remember what temple it was, but it was at the Frozen Grotto. Um, we're just gonna keep, keep on going. I'm gonna explore as much of the desert as I possibly can in today's episode and sort of move from there. So yeah, we're just gonna like go up here because this is also seemingly part of the desert, so I wanna explore that and then make our way down and defeat the boss as well. So that'll be a lot of fun. Now, I think we've already done everything you can really do around here, previous episodes. Howdy there, Trevor, welcome to our village. Some enemies are able to hide in the walls in the desert. Be careful where you dig. We already did this little music puzzle and we woke you up and then there was like, what I presume is like maybe Ganon or something. Ow, that hurt. Yeah, I still haven't figured out how to get up here though. Like this is still a total mystery to me, is how to get up there. Like I need an extra step up. Yeah, so I can get up that way. Uh. There's an unexplored ruin nearby if you're looking for something to do. It's right in the middle of the desert. And there's no way to get up there from like here, like inside. But hey, I do need a fresh shovel. I don't have any boots. There we go. Uh, what do you think of my shop? I don't get many customers out here, but that won't stop a businesswoman like me. Yeah, we already read that, but I'm still proud of you. Keep going. Uh, like if I had floaty boots, like maybe I could get up here from there or something like that, you know? Oh, it's tough to say, it's really tough to say. Hmm, and then this is the bowling, which obviously there's no way up from here either. I don't know, there must be something with the floaty boots I can do, but yeah, for right now I'm not gonna worry about it too much. It's just a treasure chest. I don't know if it even has anything specifically too important in it. It's this stuff up here that we just haven't touched yet that I wanna explore, so we've already done this area, I remember it. Um, But here is where things get Interesting. Got him. Got a bird there too. And there's a tablet, which yeah, I guess that did show up on the thing. Let's try to get, oh, I tried to get the little desert thing. Didn't quite work. Ah, whoop. Got it, okay. Is he gonna hop down here? Guess he's not. There he goes. Ow, you hit me, but I hit you. <laughs> I will call it even. And I do see a pot over this way. Yeah, there was, oh, was there a time treasure chest over there? Oh, I didn't see that. Well, let me do this again, then, because I wanna be able to make sure I get everybody. Oh, my ring shattered. That's sort of a shame. I mean, apparently that's not everybody. Yeah, there's that one thing over there. But yeah, this was a timed one, as you can see on the top which isn't always the easiest thing ever to say the least. Because of the fact that it's just hard to physically get over there. Yeah, I don't know how you do that for that part over there. All right, I got 24 steps, 20 steps. This music is so good. Come on. There it is, I did it, okay, cool. That was tough. So I either have multiplier-based vision or multiplier-based vision, huh? It's so tough to choose. And anything else over here? Not from what I can currently see. I'll go to that guy. No secrets over here. Oh, we get a heart piece for that, nice! That's why those are always worth doing. Um, so we got that and there's nothing else to do there. In this area, weirdly enough, I guess we've we've been here at some point. All right, well then I'm gonna ignore it if I can, because we've been here. But here we have not been, there's something to get. Or maybe, I, I don't know what that is. Can I go into here? Let's activate that. Okay, so if I haven't activated that, then I don't think I've been here before. So we'll check this out. Got him. So I don't, Quite want to go in there just yet. Gotcha. Where's the last enemy? Oh yeah, it's gonna be this thing. Let me get over there <laughs> if I can. Jumping on over and ah. Okay, you hurt me, but I hurt you. Once again, I'll call it even. Oh wait, there's a bee. Get the bee. I can't get the bee. There he is. <laughs> All right, let's go into here and see what's going on. It's another shop. Hello. 
I heard that there are diamonds coming from the monsters all over Hyrule. If you bring enough, you can buy some of my stuff. Oh really, so we have another multiplier based vision. L-shaped attack, that looks interesting in a bottle. I want all of this. You got an empty bottle. It can be used to store potions, fish, bees, and fairies that you find. I would like to store some stuff. I don't know why I'd want to store bees though. I used to be a traveling salesman, but there are so many monsters around now, it's not exactly the safest career choice. Gotcha. I'd offer you a discount, but since I'm only the only merchant around, uh, any price is a bargain. What do you mean this monster, uh, there's another merchant now? And he sings? Oh, beans, anything here you're particularly fond of then? I guess I need the business, yep, already got what I wanted. But yeah, I'm glad that we actually have a place to spend our gems, our diamonds, I've been meaning to find something like that. So what I wanted to do actually, a couple of things. I have the bottle, I can use that for potions, I can use that for stamina, but I could also use the, oh, actually I had a, had a bottle, oh, okay. Um, what, what else did I get? I got the, the flail, deals one damage to a single enemy in a wide range moving you forward. Huh. That's gonna be interesting to try. We'll try it to the right, because there's a deck of leaf and other stuff to get here, and a time chest. So I thought it did like an L in front of me. Maybe it does? Yeah, that did hit him. Huh, interesting. Only got 40 more steps to do this. That was good. We got weapon piercing now. Is there still more? Oh yeah, there's a Deku over here. Oh, I got you just barely. I'm literally the last one. That's awesome. We get another piece of heart for that. How cool is that? Okay, so I don't think there's any way to the right from up here, but I can go back up. I've been here before. There's another treasure chest. I'm not too worried about that. But what I wanna do is go back down this way because I've not been here before. Interesting. So I don't know how I feel about the flail. I don't think it's bad, but I think that for right now I'll stick to this because I'm really familiar with it. I'm sorry that I've been doing that a lot, but it just works. And I could try the broadsword. It really depends on the circumstance which one's better. It just almost always it's the, the spear. The one I've experienced. Like we could have gotten that guy for sure with the spear. And like there we got him, which is great, but could have gotten them sooner. Alrighty, so, oh, it's you again! I'm sorry I can't tell you more. The future is cloudy. My visions have been limited since Octavo stole my thread of wisdom. So yeah. Let's do a health of potion. Or health potion, not health of potion. Um, You got a health potion. This will completely heal you if you, if you use it when you're out of hearts. Okay. So there is that. Not really too much more to do there. But, we could start exploring some of this other stuff. I mean, we explored the most of this, I think. So we just really wanna go back down here and get this stuff done now, which will be fun. All right, yeah, let's go here and explore more of the Gerudo Desert. So that's where the broadsword can be useful for sure. There's definitely a strategy with it, especially with enemies that are maybe a bit more diagonal like this, but then they jump around like that and it gets confusing and I just prefer this. I'm so sorry. go. There we go. Got a lot of stuff done there. I am a little low on health though. More than I'd like to be. There it is. Hey, wait, there was more than one. Got him. Okay, so yeah, I know. There we go. That was weird. <laughs> okay, come on. What? Who else is here? This is a big area. Oh, there's plenty more. I got a shovel, which is good because I needed another one soon enough. All right, pick up the pace a little bit. Oh, come on. Got another geode. There it is. We got a fragile spear, which I'll use to the best of my ability. Because these are usually powerful. 
problem is that they break easy. And that still wasn't everybody. Who's still left? How many enemies is there? Almost got hit by that bomb. And there's more over there too. Let me activate this. And this might be the temple right here. I'll have to check it. Yeah, I think it is. Oh, that happened fast. What's over here though? So many enemies. No, there goes my thing. Oh well. There we go. So there has to be a way up there. But not from over this way. I do see that heart container. Gotcha. Wait, are the enemies respawning? There's like more over here now. Maybe they are. Oh, that'd be crazy if they are. Cause that's a lot. I mean, maybe I'm just getting confused. Oh, you know, this is like one of those giant like four panel areas. I'm getting it now. That's crazy. How do I get this guy? I'm not sure, to be honest with you. Yeah, I don't I don't understand. Maybe I can hit him with a bomb. It might be my best bet. Yeah, that worked. Okay. One in doubt, throw a bomb at it. There we go. There is this over here. This is probably my best bet for getting that one heart piece. But it's also probably what I'm supposed to use over here. Okay. So it might have more than one use. We'll have to wait and see. I don't have any more of a shovel? Oh, yikes, let me get this. Because yeah, I used a glass shovel. Gotta be careful with that. <laughs> glass shovel is a very limited use. Okay. Definitely interesting so far how big this area is. Makes it really feel like you're exploring the desert. See, I guess my best bet is to get this, which is a titanium short sword, which is pretty cool actually. Not exactly everything I was looking for, but you know, I'll take it for now. See, I think at this point, the only thing that has to still be around are those guys on the top or at the bottom right. The problem is I don't really have too much of a way to get to them. And if I leave and come back, I think all the enemies respawn. I'm almost positive. I don't see how else I can reach them though. I mean, some of them I might be able to get to come down to me. Oh no, there's a staircase right there. Okay, I was just being a dingus. Well, you know what? That's very common of me, isn't it? Not what I wanted. Going the wrong way. Okay. Uh, there we go. Oh, he got hit by the rock. Perfect. Ah. Come on, getting down this way. Nice, okay, so we got all the enemies and the heart piece, which means we need two more before we get our next heart. Very cool. So I think we're just about good to head into here and see what it's all about. Um, You know what, let's play this out. I haven't put this out in a couple episodes. Sorry about that, let's play this out right now. Um, And just sort of see how it goes. We're in the Garuda Ruins. I like it. Okay, so what's going on in here? Let's talk to you. I can lower the bridge with the with this machine, but I'll need three gears. They look like this. <gasps> I've seen one of those, I thought it was an enemy. They're just hanging out somewhere. How many do I have? None. All right, I know I saw one, like, up here. So am I just supposed to search every area? Not, not up here, maybe like, here. So I'm not seeing any over this way, but what I could do at the least, is like dig some stuff up. Maybe they could be, you know, hiding somewhere in that way. There's a bee. I could have used a bottle on you. That would have been great. Oh well. Um, I last I want to hop down here if I can. Yeah, none of that dropped gears, but I, I wouldn't really know until I checked, right? So, glad I did. So I'm just gonna scan through the entire desert then, looking for gears. I mean, there are stuff like this, and then I see one sort of, kind of in the sand over this way and that way and everything. 
But no, they're just sort of like pieces of the floor. I can't like dig them up or anything. But you see there's one right there next to all the birds. It's like sort of spinning around. Well, let's do something about this then. So how am I getting up to that? Hmm. What I could do, ah! Let me destroy all of these guys first before I do anything. Cause I sort of messed up my plans. Oh, how do I want to do this then? Cause I was gonna just hop up, cause I can't do that now, darn. I was actually gonna do something there that it's not gonna let me know. Yeah, I don't know what to do about this. I mean, I could. Yeah, I sort of pushed that out of the way. What do you do about this? I mean, if I could get some floaty boots, I guess I would solve my issue. Maybe I should try to find some then. Okay, so we'll try to find a shop. Several shops, probably. Um, until we find what we're looking for, some floaty boots. So where's the shop in this one? Oh, it's up there. Hmm, this is tough though. You really need to just sort of look around a bunch for it. Hmm. I mean, maybe if I use that, that gives you what you need. While I'm there, maybe, maybe it would give me what I'm, I need. I, I don't know though, I don't trust that. I feel like it's just gonna give me health or something. What other shops are around here? Uh, we have one right there, so I'll try that. Closest I can get to it is right down here though, so I'm just gonna have to sort of sneak by a bunch of enemies. Well, what is, what is in here? I don't remember. Oh, that was the only enemy around here. Okay, great. Oh yeah, this guy. Hey, but don't suppose you, you wanna buy a snorkel, you can avoid enemies by going in. Yeah, I already did that. I don't know where I'm gonna get the flippers, though. So I don't have to worry about any of these enemies. Not really my problem at the moment. And here, this is where the shop is. There we go. Nope, no floaty boots. I know they're gonna be around somewhere. We just gotta keep searching. Maybe in Kakariko Village or something, there could be some someone. And there's still um some stuff up there. So, uh, I just cleared this stuff out recently, so hopefully it's still cleared. But isn't there a shop in here? Okay, I'm sorry, chicken, but you're in the way. No, darn. I mean, I don't see how else I can get to it. I mean, there might be a, a different answer to the puzzle. I mean, how does the flat, oh yeah, this still like, doesn't make you jump an extra thing or anything, the uh, the feather. It's gonna call it a flower. Oh, maybe the hook shot. Maybe I should try that out. I don't know if that'll actually work. Okay, no, see, everything's back now. This is what I was hoping for before. Okay, so I'm gonna try to be very careful with how I do this because I've already messed it up. Darn it. <laughs> because I was gonna put one to the left of that thing. What if I just, That doesn't work? What's the point of the hook shot? <laughs> it doesn't do anything. I guess I can grab onto this. Well, I get to grab onto some things, but not others. I don't know. Come on. Can I like, no, 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 no. Oh, that was close. That's frustrating though, for sure. What if I, I don't know, I just gotta figure this out. All right, well, I can't get this one for the life of me. I don't know what the deal is, so I'm just gonna look for other ones. Maybe there's more than three I can find, and I'll just like start searching around, and like maybe there's something like under all the, the dirt. Oh, okay. Well, there's certainly stuff around here, and I can only hope that there's just. Why can I put a bomb there? That was weird. Cause I was missing the beat. Really? Oh, this is hot coal. But I guess I'm fine. I like how we can survive a little bit in lava now. That's funny to me. There we go. Okay, so what's in here? We got bomb shoes, and there we got something. How am I supposed to reach that? What are you talking about? How do I get up here? <laughs> how, do, how do I do that? What is with this game today? With this like impossible stuff? I mean, maybe there's something I can dig up. Or not. <laughs> what? How, how, how do you do that? All right, well, I'm gonna have to come back to this one. Ooh, the game is being a game today, you know what I mean? 
I just, I don't know what I'm supposed to do all about that. Okay, there's a diamond, that's cool. I guess I like, can beat up a bee or something. There's another flag over here. So like maybe these lead to more gears. Oh, one of this, one of the monsters were holding this. Maybe you can use it. Din's fire, you got Din's fire automatically. It's automatically assigned to L and only Zelda can use it. Press L to create an explosive ball of fire. It will explode if it collides with anything. You can also detonate it by pressing L. At the center of the desert lie the Gruta ruins, but the bridge inside is broken. The Gruta there seem to be seem to think we can fix the br bridge if we find them some spare gears. I've heard there are more caves like this one in the desert. Maybe you'll find something useful there. Is there a leak in here? Okay. So yeah, we can make a fireball. Oh, and we can control where it goes and explode it. Maybe that's what we need in that other room. Let's go and find out. Uh, that was down this way. I don't think so, but I mean, I guess. Yeah, okay. And that has a gear. Okay, our first of three. Maybe I could use that with that other area. For right now, I'm not gonna worry about it. I wanna keep looking for a little flags like that, and that might give me the answers I'm looking for. Hmm. I don't see too much of that over this way. But I do see this. Okay, what'll this one be? Ow, not what I wanted. That was my last of those bombs. So I'm not to use a bomb shoot, which I've never really used before. There we go. That's all I needed to do. There's my diamond. And a gear. All right. Yeah, I want the, the, the shovel with more stuff to it. <laughs> Please and thank you. So there's two gears. We know where the third one is, but there might be another one just hanging out. Like maybe that other one was just impossible to get and I've been just fooled. I feel like that might be the case. That one was like, like just aesthetic. Huh. Isn't that sort of uncool? Okay, for this one, it just seems like there's a lot of enemies to defeat. I don't think there's, ah, ah, ah. Too much more than that. There we go. Got a gear and another shovel. Yeah, okay, well there's the three, uh, sorry for my huge detour and me just being a total dingus. It just, I saw a gear earlier, you would think common sense would mean, okay, I gotta go get that gear when they're asking for gears. Finally, now we can lower the bridge, but it's gonna cost you 150 rupees. Oh yeah, that's easy. Just kidding, here we go. Oh, no, okay, we're fine. Good luck. Alrighty, I'll need it. I'll probably also need this for something, if I can pick it up, I can't. Okay. Ah, no, can't quite go down there. Soon though, I'm sure. Uh, let's go down this way. Oh boy. The music is cool here. Intense. Ow, that was not necessary. Hmm, oh, reflects projectiles, that's nice. Better than multiplier-based vision, I feel. Sorry to fans of multiplier-based vision. I still think it's been super helpful to me. There we go, we got a map already, that's nice. What's down this way? A key. All right, well, we got some enemies to defeat in here. Whoa, got this guy. Ow, that's fine, we got him. So there's my uh, staircase back up if I needed it. But I don't quite need it yet. Uh, I wanna explore more and see what else we can find. And plenty of keys and stuff. And I also wanna find whatever secrets like that might be hidden about because they're always good to find. Sort of wanna dig everything up in this floor because I always mess up the first floor of a dungeon, I don't get everything. Like I try to find all the enemies. And here I can just attack over and over again. Get some pretty cool stuff. Like you can see because of the border that there's nothing else here. I just like how they all line up to get attacked. It's like the best thing ever. There it is. Get a pre preserves durability, which is cool. Or what else? Oh yeah, I don't need the low HP once again. Not very useful to me. So what enemies are we dealing with in here? 
Oh boy. Okay, this time's not turning out so well for me. Maybe I do need that low HP thing. We'll have to wait and see. There we go. So what's this? Another key. Okay, I'll take it. We gotta be getting close to taking on all the enemies at this point. There might be a little bit more to the left. Like this keys. And then you. Got him. Gonna fire keys, but that burned me. That was very silly. Okay. I mean, that seems like most of the enemies, but there is more still over here. So let's beat them up as much as I can. There it is. That was a lot of enemies, but still not all of them, apparently. I have a hard time believing that. I'm pretty sure just there's no way. This is like the third time that we've gone into a dungeon. I'm like totally sure we found all the enemies. But the game's like, nope, there's still somehow more. Just you don't know where they are. Anyways. Oh, we got another heart piece. Gonna buy that for sure. And I do see like maybe like a little extra thing I could dig up that way. I don't know how I reached that though. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see a way to get there at all. So I feel like that's just not really anything. All right, that's not what I meant to do, by the way. <laughs> Whoops. It's just weird, I'm not really sure. Maybe it's that it just doesn't turn off until all the enemies in both parts of the dungeon are done. Like, maybe that's the thing. Okay, well, in any case, we'll just go this way. Oh, nice. Get a treasure chest, either Deku Leaf or War Drum. We're doing War Drum. You got a War Drum. Use this to skip a beat and power up your attacks on the following beat. Oh, that sounds interesting. So this right here. And then I can get attack. Huh, interesting. That hurt. <laughs> oh no. I like the idea of the war drum just because of the fact that I can sort of stay in place a little bit easier. That's a tough thing to do in this game. You can't really do that. While everybody else is moving around, you can stay in one place. What do we got in here? Oh, we got ourselves a glass flail. Ow, and there it goes. <laughs> oh well. Got him. Oh nice, we got the Torch of Wisdom, which will make this much easier. As you can see, we got a chest, and it has a compass. And then there's another glass flail over this way. With how often I'm getting hit though, might not be that useful. Oh, I got another one. Up this way we have something I'm gonna need a spear for. Ow. Oh well. 50 rupees, that's pretty good. So what else is going on around here? Yep, there's more enemies. Got him. Oh, there's some diamond, ow, over there. So what's this gonna be? Oh, the centipede thing again. Saw this at the end of the last episode. I'm not really doing very well right now but I know I can fix that. There it is. So we got ourselves a glass ray pure. Okay, so what else can we get around here? I don't know if there's too much more. And we can go to the shop and stuff. I can't quite get that diamond in the lava. I mean, I could, but we take damage. <laughs> is it worth it? Maybe it is, because I could always use the health potion. Hello. So we got a key. I'll take the bomb as well if I can. And plus two damage after dig is better than nothing. I just don't see anything else once again, as per usual. Here's another key, which is cool and everything, but I got 12 of those. I want all the enemies taken down. 
my main mission, my main goal, is feed all the baddies. Maybe something, no? Huh. Like, let me pay attention to the map. What could we possibly be missing? Everything's cleared out, so like maybe there's just another level of the of the thing. That could be the problem. Okay, yeah, so let's go down this way. Oh, there are some boots waiting for us down here, though. Nice. And yeah, let's get to it. I'm gonna go over this way, and boom. Yeah, there's more enemies. Not the bomb I want. <laughs> I can tell you that much. Maybe I could, I don't know. I could try freezing them. And then lay down a bomb. That didn't really do much. Ow. Okay, you know what? I need to drink this health potion <laughs> before something worse happens. What am I doing about this, so? Uh. Can I use a hook shot for that? Yeah, you can! That's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. Thank you. The hook shot actually did something. Okay, well that was all the enemies defeated for real, I think now. And now we can go through here and get this done. It is the boss fight of this temple. Let's figure it out. So. Oh, it's a guitar? Perhaps you're stronger than you look. Not that it matters, you'd never be able to defeat Ganon, but are you strong enough to defeat my third champion? Power of fire, set my guitar strings ablaze. Oh no. Whoa, look at this dude and his two, four buddies. Bass Guitar Mo's Knights. Oh man. I need like more time this is gonna be willing to give me. Oh boy. Oh, this is interesting. There we go. There we go. Got rid of two of them. I feel like it wouldn't be that bad of an idea to do this and then do this. And do ice arrows, maybe, because these guys are all fiery. Ow. Oh. Okay, I'm out of uh, mana for now. For now, Oh boy. No, I was trying to move. There we go. One more of these guys to deal with. Now it's just you. Ow, okay, you can just hit me that way. Let me try to stay away. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna use one of these and one of these. Barry, I gotta catch you first. What are you doing? There you go, don't go up there. There it is, we got you. Okay, the Gutarmos are taken down. We're gonna get that in a moment. Let me get the heart container first and get ourselves a bass guitar. Very cool. Glad to be able to get another thing. That's our third one done, so I'm gonna guess there's probably only like one more left to do. You got the bass guitar, you can feel a magical aura when you hold it. This may help you stop Octavo. Well, that would be great. Alrighty, so another area completed. What I wanna do now is I want to find out where we can go next. So if I go here, we should be able to talk to this lady, pay her some rupees, and she'll tell us where to go, which would be great. So let's figure that out. Hey lady, also need to spend one of my uh, bottles getting some stuff. Uh, welcome Fate's Chosen One. Oh, it's just 10 rupees, it's super duper cheap. So where are you gonna tell me to go next? I see a deep dark forest. Your fate is to make your way to the center. I've marked the location on your map. So that part's tough, because I still haven't figured this out. I have to figure out the dark forest in the next episode then. In the meantime, like I said, let's get these. I want them both to be health potions. Did that work? There you go, health potion, and health potion. There it is, thank you for your time. Okay, so if there's anything else I wanna do in today's episode, I guess it'll be to continue exploring for at least a little bit. What other things could I possibly do at the moment? Uh, 
like I said, I'm not really too worried about red chests because they obviously respawn over time. Uh, I'm looking more for boss fights like this over here. If there's anything like that I can get, that's what I need to focus on. That's what I'm focused on. I'm gonna move over here quickly. There it is. So apparently there's a boss fight or something here I missed out on. Yeah, in that cave over there. There we go. Trying to deal with all these guys, there's a lot of them. Yeah, there's a couple more enemies. I'm not gonna worry about them too much. I wanna get my health back and then go into here. So what kind of, oh my. Yeah, I guess I've never been in here. And then also, while I'm at it, can I switch this back to the drum? And then I can try this. Yeah, that didn't really do too much for that enemy. So that's the, the, the main enemy right there, the main boss. It's just tough because he can hit diagonally. Man, they can hit, they can all at me. Can you stop that? <laughs> this guy's too much. There it is, we get a diamond, we get some boots, which I think I just want the armor for right now, to be honest with you. Anything else to do around here? I guess not. Um. Yeah, okay. So there's another boss up this way that I missed out on, and like stuff like that. But first off, I should probably go and try to find a fairy real fast. I know that there's one down this way. I'm just trying to clear up stuff like this that doesn't respawn, as far as I can tell. There we go. So I wanna take a look, is there... I could, at the least, equip this and get some poison infusion. That's always good. I love the music here, it's really nice. It's very cool. Let's equip that, and let's move on out of here. So what is next? This area right over that way. Can I get up there from here? I think I can. And I might as well do that. So there's supposed to be, yeah, some kind of boss around here. I have to guess it's gonna be somewhere under a bush or something. Huh. Oh yeah, the music here is really cool. The music everywhere is really cool. Who am I kidding? <laughs> I'll, I'll destroy everybody first. Just so I can figure that out. I guess I gotta take this for now. But what I'm really trying to figure out is where in the world I'm supposed to go in terms of this secret. Because there's a secret around here. There has to be. There's a bee. Now there's no longer a bee. Isn't that weird? Hmm. I'm not really sure. Okay, that didn't do anything. There's nothing else here though, like, that's a weird thing. I mean, there's gotta be something. Probably with this rock, but I don't know what. Isn't that weird? Oh, I see, I see. There's a crack in the wall over here. There it is, gotta pay attention for that kind of stuff. Ow, should've just jumped backwards there. Okay, we got glass slippers. Uh, they break too easy, I'm just gonna keep with these. We got a mirror shield, you got the mirror shield, it automatically assigned to R and is only equipable by Zelda and Cadence. What do we unlock Cadence? An upgrade on your old shield, it can block even stronger attacks and reflect more projectiles when you hold it up. Huh. So do we just have that automatically equipped for Link, or for Zelda, or no, Link, yeah, that's what I meant, <laughs> I guess. So what else is going on around here? There's another one of those kind of things up this way. There's another one here. So we just gotta keep that going. Right now it looks like our best bet is to go down here. Ignore all these enemies. Thank you. Okay, there it is, get some extra health. Oh boy, got it. 
Do I need the extra arrows? I guess I do. Yeah, I did use a couple during the boss fight, but I have been down here at some point. You can see there's a staircase right here. I guess I might have not have defeated the boss. I might have, yeah, like, was like, okay, I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to do and left. Hmm. I'm not doing that this time. I'm gonna figure out what we're supposed to do. Oh, there he is. I got him this time. There he is, 200 rupees for that every time. That's insane. So that's everything. Okay. Oh no, <laughs> that's deep water. So I, that's all I really need. I mean, if I find anything else, it's great. Like a treasure chest with three vision. That's a glass one though. So if I get hit, it goes bye-bye as per usual with that stuff. But then there's some stuff around here. I mean, obviously I don't go through the dark woods to find this, so I might as well try it out now. Hmm. Yeah, I just like to explore a little bit after we're done with the temple. Adds a little bit more to the video, the, to the experience, right? There we go. Slowly starting to earn my health back up. I can squish this guy. Got the key. And this thing is the last enemy. Need to show back up again, come on. There it is. Yeah, I lost my one torch, so it's good to have that. So somewhere in here, there's what? Just a treasure chest? I don't think I'm surprised we haven't done. That's a weird plan over there. What is he trying to do? Is he trying to block this off? Well, you failed. There we go. Hmm, weird. Very weird enemy. Okay, well that's everything in here, so don't have to worry about that anymore. And then let's go down this way so I can get, apparently, another heart piece. I don't know if we've ever been down here. There we go, plenty of rupees right there. But then I gotta be careful, yeah, of that. That was the Deku Seed, which is nice to have. Okay. Then you, where are you gonna go? I know that that's there. Gotta get rid of the bee first. And then who else is still around? You are. And then there's another one in the water over this way. Oh, and the heart piece is right over this way, which I have the snorkel, so this should be pretty doable. Just to, yep, just do that. Interesting. And then down here, there should be a boss fight of some sort. Hmm, I don't know if there's anything I can do about this. Weird but I can do something about this. I don't know, that was a bad position for me. Wow, he dropped three diamonds? Oh, that's very generous. Oh, Dig Dash, Shovel of Courage. I don't know if I've ever seen this one before. This is new. Can't quite get across there from here. Maybe if I go back. I'm just trying to get that guy. <laughs> he ain't easy to get. There we go. And that's all of them. Huh. Well, I guess that was, yeah, that was everything. Weird, I was expecting a little bit more. Oh, we got our either dash after kill. It's good, but we, we can dig so quickly, it's insane. I actually really like that. We get some glass slippers, which I might as well keep for now. Our other boots are about out anyways. So there's that done. One last area down here in the corner. I haven't seen. So yeah, now my uh, shoes are broken. Which is a shame, but it's fine. Get some more bomb shoes. What is that guy doing way out there? Can't really get him from here. There we go. Ow. Oh boy. Come on. There you go. And then we got like a little guy on the bottom right. And we have you. 20 more rupees, it dropped so many rupees, it's crazy. We're about to hit our 3,000th rupee. There it is. He was in a weird position. See, there's everybody there. There's still like another boss fight thing here, another one there. Maybe they do respawn, because I feel like we just did that one. Maybe we didn't. Because they're not respawning up here. I, I don't know if they do. I want to check out all those, all the mini bosses. Because the red treasure chests, chests definitely respawn, like 100% for a fact. 
trying to just figure out what does and does not. I mean, it's good to still, you know, get all the rupees and get everything else, but... Oh. Gotta be careful of that. Alright, I sort of want the dig dash more. But who knows if I'd actually be able to keep that... These guys are a lot more ferocious when they work together. There we go. Oh, that was tough. There it is. So I could go over there, but I'm not going to do it. Going to it this moment. Oh, yeah, the e I remember that the evil treasure chest. Ah, green goop. So I'm going to get this back. And we gotta go down there for the thing. If I go up this way, as you can see, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> this will give me bad memories. There. Oh my gosh. What was in here then? This is where we found Caden to some point, yeah. It's another thing about making progress by end up where I'm starting. A clue of which way to go. So like, what is that clue? I figured it's the machine tingle gaming. Oh, come on, you guys it seriously had to respawn. There, okay, at least I got even more diamonds this time. I seem to remember how to, oh my gosh, this torture. Okay, I'm just gonna go down this way instead. That seems like a much smarter idea. And then I'm just gonna hop down here and see what boss we have to do with our mini boss. And it's this bomb dude. There we go, we got a glass spear. They're always good to use, they have extra damage and stuff. Then what's in here? Plus two damage. You know, I just need a new one because that one's running low anyways. So with that one done, I need to figure this one out over here. Okay. So let's use the loot. And, I mean, I'm sort of as close as I can get already, but uh, this will save me a couple of seconds. There we go. Ow, that was just rude. There goes my spear too, yeesh. So it should be somewhere around here. Don't exactly know where. I guess we can figure that one out. Yeah, I, I really don't know where this one would be. Oh, you know what, it's that cracked wall over there. I see it now. Yeah, it's very sneaky. Probably wanna get rid of this guy too. Maybe I should focus on that first. Yeah, I never noticed this before, but now that I'm looking for this stuff, it becomes much easier to find it, you know? You, you find what you're looking for, don't you? Okay, let's do this. Okay, very good. And, oh man, that guy's huge. Ow, didn't even see him over there. Ouch. Okay, we got plus three vision. There we go. Okay, so that got me a diamond. Plus three vision or, oh yeah, definitely the plus three vision. It's better than nothing. Let me get that and, oh, we got the Pegasus anklet. Hold for one or two beats and then release on the following beat to perform a dash attack. Oh, there's so many items in this game, it's incredible. Whoa, so you can dash pretty far as it is. What happens if I do that? Oh no, stamina, perfect timing. Uh, I was gonna try to do that over a gap. I don't know how that works. Cause like the, isn't there like Pegasus boots in some Zelda games? Hmm. And I've been here, yeah, okay. So I'm just trying to find out where we can go otherwise. Like here probably there's something? Weren't we just here? Yeah, what's here now? So maybe the stuff does respawn. Because I guarantee there wasn't something here before. Unless like that guy counts as one. I guess he does? Because it's not there anymore. Huh, that's weird, isn't it? Let's warp here. There's a Deku not here and stuff. Might as well, oh, I can't get there from here. So I'm gonna have to find a different way. Huh. I guess I'll go back here for now. I'll keep playing the Zelda. Didn't intend to change that. I actually wanna use that now. I've been meaning to use these potions a little bit, our scrolls. Yeah, it gives me a fairy. 
Can you please just come here though? There we go, thank you. It doesn't even fully restore my health, which is crazy. So while there is a staircase down here, I think we've already been, yeah, down here. Okay, well. I might have to leave the rest of this for next episode or something. I'm running out of time. Come on now. Get over here. Actually, no, I've not gone to the left here. Let me try that out. Hmm. So we've never been here before. Plenty of difficult enemies everywhere. I'm getting my butt kicked. And I see the secret room. It's it's that once again it's that bush with the butterfly on it. Just gotta get rid of these two. There it is. Awesome. Okay, so yeah, let's get over this way. And Okay, just this guy. Ow, that hurt, but I got him. And we get 200 rupees. And more rupees than I'll ever need. Can I pick this up? Probably can. Nothing really in it, but okay. Got that done. So with that area done, there is two more things left to explore here, but I think I'm gonna leave that for the next episode. There's still plenty more to do in this game, of course, but we'll get to doing it in the next episode of Cadence of Hyrule. If you watched this point of video, make sure you comment Gerudo Zebra, so you've watched at the end of the you are a Zebra Tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing and join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.